today is a press, uh, press conference to announce next week's Sustainable Energy Week. It is from the 22nd to the 30th of June. It is a worldwide event that takes place all over the world, initiated by the European Union. It's mainly to really reach out to the citizens of countries to make them aware how important energy efficiency is and how they can actually save money being more conscious and using specific tools. The fund was established in 2009 actually during the Swedish chairmanship of the European Union and uh, it was an initiative to, um, to increase environmental and energy savings investments in the, um, in the Eastern Partnership area and it was decided to start with Ukraine. The fund has today allocated 35 million of the 92 million to, five, to nine different projects in Ukraine and we, of the nine projects we have signed five projects. It is always hard to be the first in any city, but the energy efficiency projects that we are implementing in Zhytomyr and other Ukrainian cities are the only solution for future development in terms of increasing the standards of people's lives and decreasing utilities bills. That's why I've started cooperation with international organizations such as the E5P Fund, USAID, World Bank, European Bank for Reconstruction and Development, as well as others who have helped us launch energy efficiency projects in Zhytomyr. We are starting at the beginning in our process of catching up with the countries where renewable energy sources are already developed. That's why we are implementing national plans to boost our renewable energy levels, and today we are witnessing positive dynamics where we double or sometimes triple our annual amount of energy obtained from renewable sources.